Dozens of students had to be relocated after a fire broke out inside of a dorm at Russell Sage College's Troy campus. Yeah, nobody got hurt. That's the good news there. News and ABC's Cassie Hudson has reaction from the school community as they look into what caused the fire. No, I wasn't scared, but I was confused. One student reacted right away to signs of smoke, calling public safety and 911 as the fire alarm was going off. There was a heavy smoke condition in the building, so we had, to, we had to make sure we went through floor by floor to make sure everybody was out of that building. The fire was contained to two dorm rooms, causing minimal damage to the building. The Troy Fire Department credits the students and staff for their quick response to the situation. We take the health and safety of our students very seriously, and fires are exactly the kind of thing that you prepare for. I mean, we have fire drills, we have building captains, and everything that they've been taught to do unfolded exactly as it should have been. The college says they're relocating 75 student residents and one professional staff member to other campus housing facilities on the Troy campus. So it was a small fire, but a small fire often generates a lot of water to put it out. So we expect it may be a few weeks uh, before the dorm is ready for people to move back in. Um, it's definitely a mess. Yeah. Like it's very like unorganized. Everyone's like frantically trying to pack up quickly. It's probably super tough on them. It has like there's like a weird smell inside kind of like yeah like burnt. on Thursday afternoon the students with help from friends and family allowed back inside Kellis Hall to collect their belongings from the building getting a helping hand from student athletes who volunteered to help their peers move out yeah it's a big thing for our school is making sure that our community is built up the best that it can be I don't live on campus but I have people that are in my program that need our help so we decided to come together and all the teams are involved in that the cause of the fire remains under investigation as far as the students, the campus says that they've made counselors available on campus following last night's events. Reporting in Troy, Cassie Hudson, News 10, ABC.